updates for dating guys and welcome to clutter butter playing some dark souls 3 we're gonna go ahead and start a new game here now i've never played this game before so uh bear with me just gonna go ahead and skip that cutscene because i'm sure you guys have all seen it before we change our gender to female and go with the knight because i always play the knight um burial gift not sure if i want the souls or the life ring I'll probably go with the life ring raises max hp you can always get souls later name clutterous None of this really matters because you don't really get to see your character anyway. Because I'm going to have like a full set of armor on at all times. Meh. Let's go with that. Cemetery of Ash. So, I'm in game here. I've played uh, Demon Souls before. And that's about it. I can play a little bit of the first Dark Souls. And uh, completely skip Dark Souls 2. Chop that guy up right quick. Oh god, he's still alive. Oh. Really let those guys fuck me up right there. I forget that every time you rest, it brings everybody back to life. So we're gonna have to like just chop through these guys again. I'm not gonna drink quite yet, but I've seen this uh this area before. I'm gonna pull the sword out of this guy and he's just gonna spring to life. I have seen a couple spoilers for the game. This guy's pretty easy. Oh my god. This is like the worst possible time for me to be like lagging right now. Oh my god. Oh, get wrecked. This is probably the part that's going to lead to my untimely death. Flasking up, baby. You guys see those clutch rolls right there? Oh shit. Oh, hoo hoo hoo, marked him. I almost died there. That was pretty, that was pretty iffy. Alright, so we're Embered, so that means that uh, red dudes can invade our game now. But I can also summon people, I guess, if I have that summoning stone thing. Chopped him up into pieces. Go ahead and kick him off the edge there. Get off the edge. Go. Get off the edge. Homeward bone. What the hell? Oh, this is the Firelink Shrine. I remember this from uh, Demon Souls. We'll just up our strength a fuck ton. Where the fuck do I go now, man? Ah, you have to stick the sword in. Been running around for ages trying to figure that out. I guess we'll rest at the bonfire. Can't really do much. High Wall of Lothric it is, I guess, since it's the only place we can go. Here we are at the High Wall of Lothric. Looks like this is the way to go. Opening doors in this game is always so dramatic. Ew. Jumping required ahead? What in the hell? Did 
Dude, what shot me? What the hell? <laughs> just gets shot in the back out of nowhere. Oh, I see him now. This guy's pretty lanky. Damn, those guys are tanky. Oh, shit. I feel like this dude is stronger than the first boss was, bro. Like, he's going ham on me right now. So, uh, fuck that guy. To the bonfire! That didn't work out the way I thought it would. Time to kill everyone again. Rest in peace. Try dragon, eh? At this moment, he knew he fucked up. Oh, my god. Jesus. Nail them. Get wrecked, noob. Get wrecked. Well, now I have no potion left. That's cool. That's that's cool, I guess. It's always so dissatisfying when you die to see just the like subtracted number of souls that you had. That was cheap. That was super cheap. Kinda hate this game right now. Thank you guys for watching my Dark Souls 3 video. And I uh, hope you guys enjoyed me dying over and over again like a noob. Uh, stay tuned for part 2. And I'll see you in the next video. This is Blair signing out. Peace.